Greetings all, it is I, Sam Farron, and welcome back to Let's Translate Trails at Dawn 2 Crimson Sin. I just started up the game, and look at that title screen, goddamn. So last time we finished the interlude chapter, and... Well, who knows what's gonna happen from here. I, I don't know if we're gonna be, like, splitting up again... ...for the chapters, but... I guess we'll find out in, like, literally a second here. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. I think we're... I think chapter 3, or... ...whatever, is gonna be, a. Uh, all as one group, maybe. But yeah, if you haven't watched the last video, I'd recommend doing so. Otherwise, you're not going to have much context. Well, that being said, we did just get forward five days. But yeah, a lot happened in the last one. We're back in Edith. Wow, I never expected this to happen. Uh, even Nadia, oh. Uh, thanks for letting me stay here. Sorry that I'm slacking on my on helping you guys out, but yeah, uh, from Nachan. <laughs> I mean, if we think about it normally, she's got to be going after Swin, right? Yeah, it has to be it. Like these last five days, she's always been, uh, like she's been, uh, really beat up about it. It makes sense with, uh, how they, like, or how he parted with her, though, Garden Master. Garden Master. I heard about what was going on with him afterwards, but... He was, like, the Squirt's partner and, like, kind of his older brother. And as for the girl, like, he was actually her straight-up, like, real brother. Nadia said that it couldn't be him. But I guess for Swin, uh, he didn't feel the same way. I didn't really ask them much about it two years ago when I accepted their request. He was a partner to Swin, and they'd gone through so much together in a few years. And he was also the brother of Nadia. Uh, who they got like who got split up from her like before she was really that old I guess they both knew different sides of him so maybe that was why but to think he'd go so far as to like leave his partner and uh, go to like side with the enemy he said that this was his repentance didn't he the, we have no way of knowing just how much weight that word carries for him. Well, including Nadia, we can't just like leave them both to it. We also had seven of the eight Genesis stolen from us. Yeah. But thanks to you, Van, we at least managed to keep this one. It's been shining ever since we got back to the capital, hasn't it? Yes, quite faintly, but, like, pretty consistently. I think that it's, like, uh, synchronizing with the other Genesis. So that means there's someone in the capital? Or somewhere in the capital? What the hell are they trying to do with the seven Genesis that they took? Well, no doubt something worse than uh, ever before. 
maybe even worse than what Almata tried to do. Seems like their kind of a relationship with the Oathbreaker and those crazy twins has ended at least, but. I've been increasing my like uh, information network, but I think it might be time for us to finally leap into action soon. Uh, before something unthinkable happens, right? Uh, good work, Quatra. I guess you're done strengthening the network facilities, eh? Yeah, it was a perfect job for me to do after coming back. After everything that happened, I managed to heal my stamina pretty quickly. In fact, I feel better than I did before. Mm, that's great. Yeah, it looks like you're feeling a bit better in yourself now. Yeah, good for you. Looks like getting in contact with the professor really helped you out, eh? Yeah, that was uh, the best medicine for me. I managed to talk to Ellie uh, properly as well. That everyone learned about the secret that I'd hidden, and that there was some of that power from that angel still left in me. But uh, don't forget, Quatra, that's uh, all a part of you. You must have realized, though, by coming face to face with your pain, there are people that will accept you no matter who you are. So use this opportunity to think about like, how you want to live, both as an, like a researcher and as you yourself. But if you don't know what to do, then uh, feel free to like come and talk to us anytime, okay? You got both us and fans group like on your side, okay? Uh, I'm the only one that gets to decide what I am. So I'm going to be thinking for a while. I won't deny this power and I'll try and like make use of it too. I want to make use of everything I've gotten in this life for the sake of the world as a disciple of uh, Professor Hamilton. Uh, Quatra. You've got a really nice uh, expression on your face right now. And we'll support you too, as your uh, fellow Spriggans. <laughs> well, if we're talking about weird powers, I guess both me and uh, the Chief have similar things, right? Uh, yeah, there'll be nothing better than uh, when you learn to control that power. So I'll be expecting great things of you going forward. Theo and Zeros are with you too. Yeah, I know. Thanks, guys. Oh, it looks like you're all together. Elaine. Uh, looks like even you guys are... Uh, couldn't find out like where they were. Yes, uh, I haven't been able to find out anything about like where Swin or the Garden Master are at the guild. And also with the Crimson Armor Demon running around, 
Uh, I want to, like, I can't ignore what you guys are doing either. So, just as I said before, I want to form another unofficial alliance with you guys. Elaine, that's so reliable having you around. And I hear that a lot of the other powers that have heard about this are coming into the capital one after another. And uh, in that sense, the smell around the capital has completely like begun to change. And uh, with Quatra back in action, I think now's a good time. So that we can find the enemy lurking in this city and bring back Swin and Nadia. Starting with Bermotti, who's uh, gathering info on this. I want to make use of all my connections and go around. You're ready, right, guys? Yeah. Oh, uh, he learned the craft Exia Ray. I'm there. I don't know what language that is. Oh, hello. Yo, I got a report from Mardic Support. Yeah, you already know it. I don't need to translate it. There's another fucking layer of the garden, eh? Yeah, seventh floor. Let's check this out together, because why not? There might be another character that I can... Uh... That'll get introduced, maybe. Or not introduced, but like, it'll go into the garden. I just want to show this, because I want to... It'll be a new, uh... Really a cheeky what, what? Oh, right, yeah. Bruh. I'm not going to do this now. I just want to kind of wander around a little bit. Show off this new floor of the garden, basically. The forest. Uh... We gotta kill three middle monster kind of things. Why is Quatrin? That's weird. I'm a. Uh... Well, Swin's a. Uh... <gasps> Gone, bro. Oh, yeah, I still got uh, Shizuna with me here. We love Shizuna on this, on this channel. Yeah, so no new party members for Garden, it's... But for some reason, I wasn't expecting to be able to play as uh, the other people that we just got done uh, fighting. Oh, the, yeah, these are stretchy guys, aren't they? Oh, yeah. Uh, I, I, th I don't think I've shown this yet, but... If I can peel your ears. Because uh, we got a banger playing right now. The only problem is it's so long that uh, hardly any enemies, like... Like, hardly any fights last long enough for it to actually, uh, like, do the full loop. Apparently these guys are weak to arts. I think they said that in the last place. But yeah, I, uh, lied. I said that I was gonna take a break and, like, edit videos. But it's, it's only the day after I finished recording, uh, chapter finale yesterday. I'm already back on my shit. I don't know, I'm, I'm not sure how long this game is, but I've heard that it is quite a bit shorter than, uh, than the first game, or it does seem that way. I know there's a post-game too, but I would, if possible, I'd like to finish this game by Christmas. That would be very hype. There's only one reason for that, it's because I'm uh, going to be going home to visit my parents. And I can't be bothered to bring my recording set up, so I at least want to finish the main game. Before then, if possible. What is that hitbox? Jesus fucking Christ. That hitbox is not okay. That was hitting me from like super fucking far away. <laughs> Is there another enemy? Oh yeah, it's like some weird plant thing. 
What hit me, bro? What, we getting cheese in here? Fuck this. Oh, it must be that thing. Oh, this fuck. Yeah. Oh my goodness gracious. What is that? Alright, well, we, we gotta do this. God, I hate. Oh, I need to figure out whatever that fucking attack is. For, like, future reference. Alright, good. Dude, she's fucking scared for some reason, bro. Right there, we go, much better. Yeah, right after I got done. Oh, yeah, so it wasn't these guys that were hitting me, it was that fucking weird plant thing. Yeah, at least I know what enemies to look out for in this place, then. Alright, there we go. Yeah, just as I was saying that no fights last long enough for the fucking song to lube. Get into like a full on, like, five minute long battle there. Nah, I doubt it was that long. Oh, very good experience here, though. God damn. Anya's is, uh, Frost leveled up. God damn. Alright, well, that's enough, uh, from this. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna find the exit and then I'm gonna leave this place. I'll do the rest of it off screen. Yeah, so it's these guys. What the fuck do they do? I just want to see. Yeah, okay, so they shoot really small looking seeds. That's what they do. Right, yeah, I'm out of here though. And they hit like eight times. God. Alright, we out of here, boy. Oops. Yeah, you gotta select the exit. Bro. Alright, there we go. Yeah, so I'll worry about that later. There's probably gonna be a whole bunch of side quests and stuff. I think even if this video ends up being long, I mean the last few videos I've done have been like I think pretty much all the videos I've done have been like over 30 minutes recently. That's kind of how it tends to be. I start off these games, I, I have like like somewhere between 15 and 20 minutes. Maybe sometimes slightly over 20 minutes for my uh video length, and then uh, it just gradually gets longer and longer. Oh, so this is Nadia's room. Wait, wait how do you get out to the roof then? Uh, this is Nadia and Swin's room. Ooh, they shared a room, did they? Cheeky. Oh, yeah, yeah, so, uh, old man Burgard left, so this became, like, an empty room. I guess they were using it. But right now, uh, Nadia, I hope that she's not pushing herself. Yeah, she was just holed up in our room for a few days, like, after we came back. And, uh, she was, like, Paulette was worried about her because she wasn't eating properly. And whenever we, like, called out to her, she'd hardly say anything or just ignore us. Or I guess maybe she didn't even notice that we were, like, speaking to her in the first place. It's like she just lost her will to live. Yeah, that just shows how much of a shock this must have been for her. Well, if she's, uh, moving with a clear goal in mind now, I guess that's better to how she was the last few days, at least. Although she might be going overboard, so that is like a worry. Yeah, we need to bring her back. Yeah. Alright, so I see one side quest marker. Oh, this is the roof, yeah. Fucking... Ah. Uh, it's like he's, uh, fucking like getting worked up and then now he's depressed, what? Yeah, I wonder if something happened, uh, with his cat friends. That foreshadowing, maybe, for a side quest? We're gonna have to rescue some cats. Dude, I remembered the... It made me really fucking depressed. Uh, it was it was like a while ago in like chapter 2, I think. It was when uh, we were doing that side quest for the boy that survived Crail Village. He just so happens to be here. The, he was uh, one of the ones we did the quest for when we, when we went to find their cat. Like, their cat had run away. Because there was a bunch of weird stuff going on in Crail when we went there. 
It was affecting the cat, so we went and found the cat. Then I guess the cat got caught up in the blast. I mean, obviously it did, but part of the reason why that kid was depressed, I don't think I mentioned it there, is because he saw a cat that looked just like him. And he, he like, tried to find it, but then he realized it was a different cat. Anyway, let's see what's uh, going on here. Oh, this is just a... Yeah, it's from CID. It's a monster quest in the park. And that's it. Okay. Well, we probably got like eight more. Yeah, we got... We got well, just two more because, yeah, this is uh, the dark park. I guess let's just go in order. I'll do Riverside now and then I'll just keep going down the list. Still got happy music in uh, Edith, though. Oh, uh, what? You're here too? Bad. Ah, uh, yes, I was just exchanging information with this lady here. Uh, I'm guessing uh, the reason you came here is because of that thing with Nadia that you just told me um, like over the phone a second ago. Yeah, well, there's a lot of other reasons too. Uh, like, honestly, I just want like anything to go off right now. I heard from Bermati too, but I think even Nadia ran off. Uh, do you find out anything? I mean, I'm searching, but uh, nothing so far. It seems that Nadia was uh, like rated you quite highly as an information broker. So I thought maybe she'd uh, come here and like check in on you, or like ask for info. Well, I was the one who introduced them, so yeah. And I already like asked him to look for info on Swin, so... She must have known that if Bermati knew something, then uh, he'd tell me and then I'd tell her. So she figured that uh, there's no point coming here, I guess. Uh, if only I'd found something out sooner, then this wouldn't have happened. Well, the guild didn't find out anything either, so it couldn't really be helped. The same goes for Garden Master and uh, the Oathbreaker too. No one's been able to find anything about them ever since what happened on Nemeth Island, it seems. And all the rumors about the Crimson Beast too, that uh, everyone was so worked up about have like, completely settled down too. I was also like worried about that, so that's why I came. Messeldam, Langport, and then in Mem Nemeth Island. Like, all these things are going on, and yet none of it seems to get reported on. So it's not like you're being restricted on, like, what you can report on? Well, obviously we're not allowed to report on everything. That's, like, the same, uh, like, in every case. It seems like all the media seems to think there's, like, no point in, uh, reporting it in the first place. Right now, it's pretty peaceful all around the Republic. It's, like, completely different to when, uh, Almato is doing stuff behind the scenes. Yeah, I'm sure it's partly because, uh, Gerard was, like, so obsessed with spreading fear, but... That Garden Master's goals and methods are completely different to, like, what our martyrs were. Yeah, that honestly makes it even more creepy, to be honest. I hope that by the time he does something, we're not, like, too late to stop it. Yeah, there's no doubt that he's planning something, but we can't find, like, a single clue as to what it is. Uh, I'll keep on searching from here, too. If I find something, I'll definitely tell you. And I'll ask around at my place, too. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> Alright. Is that all in Riverside? I guess it is. I guess we got, like... We got two more places where we have to go. Hmm. I'm not sure if I want to do it all in this episode. I'm, I probably will. It's not that much. But I want to check these uh, bulletin boards, too. Uh, it's so like lonely without those two here. Yeah, I know they're only like temporary, but they really felt at home here. It's fine. Once we, uh, or, like if we chase the enemy or garden master, we'll definitely see them. Yeah, uh, for now, let's just hit up everywhere uh, that like seems suspicious. Right, let's see what this is there. Uh, oh boy. Okay, this is from uh, Mediator Conrad. And the title is uh, 
like immigrant workers that like keep going uh, missing. And the text says, uh, I basically mediate uh, for like jobs for like foreigners that uh, have like circumstances. And my name is Conrad. I heard about you Spriggans from a certain place, so I want to rely on you. Recently, uh, there have been a lot of immigrant workers that have gone missing in the capital, specifically people that have come from uh, the northern like, poverty area of the continent. Uh, I have no idea why, but if it keeps going, then my place, my mediation office, will like be suspected of being involved with their disappearance. Uh, I'd like to speak to you further on the rooftop of the department store. Worrying. Let's uh, check out the next place there. <laughs> and it was kind of nice not having any real side quests in that other one. I mean, I guess there was one real side quest. And then there was just one monster quest. No, there were two, weren't there? There were two monster quests. What the hell's going on over here? Yeah, I don't really care about talking to that guy. Something. Oh, there's a, another monster here. Just this one's from the guild, though. It's for uh, it's like in the underground of a side side and district. Sweet. Wow. Okay, that's that's interesting. So there's only one proper quest. I was expecting more, but that's that's fine. Down here? Oh, I guess so. Uh... What? Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> Dude, Ferry said it just as they loaded in, <laughs> bruh. Oh wait, I need to do the text. Huh? Uh, over there, is that? It's uh, Sarah and Shahina. They came to the capital. Uh, yeah, they belong to the same agency office that I do. Uh, and they're pretty popular. They're fucking living it up. Uh, good work on your dance, uh, Sarah and Shahina. Yo, fairy and everyone. <laughs> I didn't think we'd see each other here. Yes, we've been so busy, so we haven't been able to contact you, but yeah, long time no see. Yeah, I guess it's been uh, like since uh, the end of the year. I'm glad to see you're doing well. Yeah, and uh, your performance was pretty good too. And that dance move you've been practicing for ages uh, looked really good there. <laughs> yeah, I'm uh, glad we got you to watch us rehearse that one time. So, uh, yeah, I'm so glad to meet you all again, Van, guys. Mm, yeah. But man, it feels weird to meet you guys without making an appointment first. You think this could be fate, uh, Big Sis Sarah? Oh, Shahina. My god, we just met and they're already yapping. But I'm relieved to see both of you haven't changed. Yeah. Hey, that's not true. I've totally changed a bit. See, look at me. I've, uh... I'm so much more grown up and sexy now. <laughs> I think you're imagining it. I think it's great that you've gotten some, uh, self-confidence. Uh, Shahina, you can still keep going. Let's, uh, do our best together. Wait, even fairies are trying to console me? <laughs> Yeah, but uh, enough joking around. I think uh, Big Sis Sarah's definitely gotten a bit more sexy, don't you? 
Uh, me? Uh, Shahina, what are you saying? And now that you mention it, yeah. Indeed, I think that uh, dancing for that many people has, like, increased your charm. Like, you've always had what it takes, but I feel like now your natural sexiness as a woman is, like, overflowing, uh, like, more naturally than before. Like, you've got more confidence now, I guess. I reckon if you wanted to go down a more sexier approach from now on, you'd, uh, do well. Like, I can guarantee it. Uh, Judith? Well, uh, you just got acknowledged from one of the biggest actresses out there, so I think it's pretty good for you. Oh, well, if you say so, Van, then, uh, I guess I can keep going like this. But, uh, make sure not to get tricked by any, uh, bad men, okay? A lot of them will try and get close to you from now on, I bet. Uh, don't worry about that, uh, Sis doesn't have any, uh, interest in those kind of men. Oh, really? Uh, well, anyway, uh, everyone, you seem to be busy, so... Uh, like, we gotta prepare for our next stage, so we're gonna go back. Yeah, uh, I guess it'll be bad to overstay our welcome. Oh, honestly, big sis. Alright, guys, bye-bye. I'm surprised you were on such good terms with, uh, those beautiful sisters, but, uh... Well, I'm glad to see that they're doing well, uh... It's almost hard to believe that they were caught up in that event last year. Yeah, we're supporting them, too. That's it, we didn't, like... Talk to anyone about, uh... Our missing kids. Yeah, I guess that's everything for... Treon Tower. Wait, no, not there. Go to the central market then. And that'll end our little tour of the city. All right, who's waiting for us here? I thought we were going to see more of like the powers. Or like, you know, people like Shizuna and uh, Zhao and stuff. Oh, hey. Hey, you guys, you came to the capital? Yo, uh, I was thinking about, like, coming to contact you guys, but, uh... Yeah, uh, long time no see, guys. Well, aside from, uh, Aaron and Van and that. And Jack and Hull, long time no see. Uh, what happened? Why'd you, like, come all the way to the capital? Yeah, well, honestly, it feels, like, more peaceful in Langport now. But I figured if something was gonna happen, it was gonna be here, and that's why we came. Well, there hasn't been anything, uh... Outstanding, really, since the Nemeth Island incident, but... We're searching for some, uh, kids that have run away from home. Uh, but you haven't met them, so we'll, we'll try and do something about it ourselves. Really? Uh, well... I'll tell you if I find out anything, uh... Like, suspicious. But you said that the Shining City had calmed down, right? What happened with Heiyue? I mean, it's not quite official yet, but pretty much everything's been settled. Exactly as, uh, Zhao planned. Tch, of course. I mean, we heard about his reasons and stuff on the island, but... <laughs> it still kind of, uh, pisses me off a bit. Yeah, apparently Zhao left the Lu house and started his, no his own Elder House, right? If you told me that before, I would've thought you were joking, but... I mean, he does seem like the kind of guy who, who could pull it off. And by the way, uh... Old Man Gian and Big Man Fan from the Lu house have actually come to the capital, I think. Oh, those two did? Uh, but why though? Well, since they've lost Zhao, I reckon the Lu house has a lot of, uh, things to deal with. But there's a chance that they didn't just come here to negotiate, like, business stuff. Well, either way, uh, it doesn't seem to have anything to do with what we're looking after, or looking into, but... Yeah, right now we gotta focus on, uh, what we're chasing after. Yeah, good luck. Garden Master, was it? Uh, we'll keep that in mind, so if we find anything, we'll let you know. Well, for now, I think I'm going to go uh, mess around in some of the casinos here. Don't go too hard, though. I don't want you getting into trouble. Actually, maybe I should go with you just to make sure. <laughs> You're like his uh, guardian. Hey, shut it. Hmm. Wait, what? Is there another place here? Uh, that's weird. I bet if I... If I leave, it'll say something, right? Yeah, I thought so. Oh, Bomati, what's up? 
今ちょうど新鮮なネタが入ったところでね。Well, you see, I just got some fresh info. あちゃんもそろそろおかわりが欲しかった頃でしょ。I bet you guys were just in the mood for some、uh, new info, am I right? <laughs> How kind of you, sir.、Uh, what kind of info is it? Well, apparently something happened in the Dark Light Town's abandoned area. The abandoned area? Oh, that like broken down area where the Red Fairy appeared. It's also a place where a few fugitives go and like mess around there, but.、Uh, so, what the hell happened there? Yeah, well,、uh, there's some rumors that some people that are, or like a person that isn't usually seen around there is、uh, going in and out of there recently. And I don't know if these two things are connected, but I heard that、uh, some of the monsters down there that had been killed with、uh, needles. Wait, that could be Nadia's? Yeah, that's all I've got.、Uh, no, that's a great clear. So, should we go and investigate? Yeah, let's head down there when we're ready.、Uh, thanks a lot, b a m a t i I owe you one. <laughs> you don't have to owe me for this.、Uh, please rely on me whenever. Well, I, I think I just teleported to the Dark Light Town because I was just thinking of messing around there. Plus, I like the music. But yeah, we're here. Well, I'm going to do some side quests. And、uh, next time, we're going to go search for Nadia down here. So I'll see you guys then.